actually uh, preparing to take off. I'm heading to Long Beach to the agenda show. Um, the agenda show is a big trade show of uh, streetwear, um, skate, and surf. Uh, basically, I'm going to head out. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Um, right now, I'm actually uh, preparing to take off. I'm heading to Long Beach to the agenda show. Um, the agenda show is a big trade show of uh, streetwear, um, skate, and surf. Uh, basically, I'm going to head out there uh, just to get some inspiration, um, ideas, get, get the mind going, um, get me back in the game of uh, creating, actually. So... I'm really excited. Um, they have this trade show, like I said, once once a year they have it, and I've been missing the last few years. But I want to get back in there and um, see what's out there, see what's trending, and just be mixed in with the culture that's out there, man. Um, as you guys know, I have a, a small business and I sell hats, and uh, I've been doing a little bit designing, so I want to get some of my products out in my shop, you know. So there you go. So. Um, Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button if you haven't. And more videos to come. I've been slacking on my videos. Uh, last year, 2017, was a really difficult year for me. Um, but that's when I started uh, doing some vlogs. And I want to keep them com coming. I want to keep them rolling through. Um, and yeah, so that's where I'm at. So um, like I said, uh, hit the like, subscribe, or even drop a comment. Hit us up. Check out the website. Check out our shop. We're here in Santa Barbara, California. Um, but yeah, that's about it, man. Um, stay tuned. Let's roll. home in Santa Barbara um, yesterday I had the opportunity to head out to Long Beach to the agenda show as you could tell um, I was excited to go over there and um, check out the the agenda show for 2018 um, so I'm just gonna break it down real quick to you guys of, uh, of how my experience went out there um, with the good and the bad um, everybody obviously who was there had a different experience from from what I had um, the last time I went there was a few years ago. Um, the vibe was totally different. Um, I got there pretty late the last time. Um, so I didn't really get to do a lot of networking, check out the, the booths. I just walked through the um, through the expo real quick because I, I got there really, really late. So this time I wanted to get there kind of early, have a few, few hours to roam around, um, take my time, not rush it, and just, you know, um, enjoy the show. Um, so yesterday I took off and, um, I get there and I started walking the whole expo. Um, you know, obviously I, I checked in, I got my badge and whatnot and, uh, put my badge. I took in my badge inside of my shirt. Um, so I started walking the expo, um, the aisles down the aisles, the different, uh, sections that they had, the woods. The, I'm not sure what other, the surf section, the skate section, the pins and patches section, the women section. Um, so I, I went down every aisle and uh, the experience that I had um, basically uh, was non-existent. Um, um, the, the vendors were not approaching me. Um, I walked through every booth, walked by every booth and everybody be on their phones you know just not giving me the time of day which i i found kind of odd you know 
and it was booth after booth after booth. And uh, mind you, I wasn't really there to be a buyer. I was there just to get inspiration, like I was telling you guys earlier. And uh, who knows, maybe make some connections, open up a new account. Um, so, so I was down there again. I was going down the booths, the, down the aisles, checking out the booths and the cool stuff that's out there. And what I found odd was like, you know, everybody was just, you know, on their phones. All the vendors were on their phones. They weren't even, they weren't being inviting. They weren't greeting me or nothing. So I'm like, okay. I walked the whole expo. I was tired. My feet were kind of hurting. So I'm like, I'm going to grab something to eat, chill at one of the, um, one of the tables that they have set up over there. So I'm eating my burrito and shit. And uh, one of the homies from Santa Barbara actually uh, approached me. I've never met this dude in my in, in my life, um, but I do follow him, follow his work on Instagram, and uh, he must have recognized me because the hat that I was wearing. So he approached me and he and we started chit chatting and shit. And I was letting him know like, hey man, this the vibe is totally off here. Like I'm, I don't know, it feels weird. And I was telling him how like the people weren't. You know, being inviting and like, you know, trying to sell anything. They were just on their phones. And that's when um, he said, yeah, man, that's why I have this badge here. You know, it lets the vendors know that, you know, you're a buyer. And uh, they'll, they'll do, you know, they'll, they'll actually talk to you and shit like that. So I'm like, oh, shit. The whole time I had my badge tucked into my shirt. So my thought was, okay. Maybe I, they thought I was probably some other vendor just walking around being nosy or whatnot. So, like I said, I was already tired. I was hungry, so I was eating. And I'm like, all right, I'm going to give this another shot, but I'm not going to walk the whole expo. I'm going to walk towards the, the, uh, the, like the skate booths and stuff like that and um, go give it another try. So I went and I bought another beer. I'm going to walk them. And again, you know, some some people were just, you know, not giving the, me the time of day so i'm like all right and then there was like three other booths that actually did approach me they asked they asked me where i was from do i own a shop and basically that was it like they weren't they weren't here's my card some some people did give me their books um of their merch and stuff like that which was cool two of them the other one it's like nothing i'm like okay which um and enter their booth and they have some pretty cool shirt designs and stuff like that, but other than that, the vibe was totally weird. It was just I don't know, man. Like um, I don't I don't know if the, the majority of those vendors were the actual owners that were just paid to be there, um, but I didn't see no energy in a majority of them. Um, so I don't know. Uh, other than that. Some cool displays, some cool booth dis uh, displays that were out there. Um, the food was pretty bomb. I don't know what was missing, man. I felt like there was something missing. Um, but I don't know. Um, I'm going to try to head out to another agenda show, give it another shot, uh, and see how that goes. But that was my experience, man. Um, hopefully something changes. I don't know. The, the vibe was just not there. I don't know. It was just kind of like... Um, Kind of sad in a way. I don't know if it was missing music or what was going on. You know what would have been cool? I don't know if they had a panel of talkers. That would have been something I would have been interested in in uh, in uh, participating in, uh, watching um, some of the companies talking in the panels and stuff like that. Um, but I don't know if they had it this, this January. I must have missed it. I did not download their app, which maybe I should have. Uh, so little things uh, I'll try doing next time I'm out there. But that was my experience. Hopefully uh, I get a better experience next time. That's it. See you guys soon. Peace.